we pulled into Terralanga, Texas yeah. in early February, and man, did we love that area. Finishing up one night here at um, Hilltop RV Park in Fort Stockton, Texas. We stayed here overnight on our way to Terralinga. We just finished up th two weeks, two and a half weeks at Cam Fimfo, Texas Hill Country in New Braunfels, Texas. And that's kind of in between San Antonio and Austin. We really enjoyed that place. It's beautiful. It was super quiet which was really nice and we actually extended by about three days because of the ice storm that was coming uh, during the week and we were able to just stay in place which was really nice and uh, safe so that was good so um, today we're headed to Terralinga we're really looking forward to going to Terralinga we've been looking forward to that one for quite a while we'll be able to spend some time in Big Bend National Park and um, do some motorcycle rides, maybe some hiking if we can find the easy trails. And uh, just looking forward to two weeks down in Terralinga, Texas. Small campground right off the road. Nothing special, mm -hmm. just flat, good sites. Uh, we did have full hookup. Mm -hmm. I want to say like pea gravel kind of yeah, thing. Yeah, almost like bit, bigger rock. Yeah, maybe a little bit bigger. So the closest Dollar General, Roger Peeler, <laughs> Ben Cox, yeah. uh, was like 56 miles away. The closest CBS. Yeah. 230 something miles away you were out there now they did have a gas station a few restaurants maybe 15 20 miles away mm -hmm. but other than that yeah you're remote yeah you're out there with the wild donkeys yeah walking through the campground yeah, <laughs> yeah. and the wild horses yeah So Terralinga, Texas, Roadrunner Campground is right in the middle. Big Bend National Park is three miles this way. Big Bend Ranch State Park is 10 miles that way. Either direction, you have amazing motorcycle riding for us, driving for other people. Like, it was awesome.
addition to exploring Big Bend National Park, we also we also met some awesome people at the campground. Terry and Leah's. Yep. Yeah. So they had been at the campground about four months or so. They had they'd been there Camp year Rory after host. year. Yeah. So they were the campground hosts and they had come for several years. Uh, Terry took you motorcycle riding. Yeah, he knew all of the back roads, off roads, uh, which was great. He showed me some Indian artifacts. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep. Exactly. Oh. oh, I see handprints. Yeah. Oh, I know there's some better ones in there. Go ahead. Yeah. So that one's yeah. Right there. There's a little hand. Yeah. They had painted all over this. Yeah. 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 Holes. Up oh, oh, there's some more right there. And then uh, Liz took us on an amazing hike on one of our last days at the campground. She got us lost. <laughs> so Liz, Liz knows Big Bend National Park. Yeah, she does. And, and she also has a, a great sense of adventure. So yeah, she's like, she map, does. I don't need a map. She don't need a map. I know where we're going. And so she actually... She did. She did. <laughs> she did. So she and her sister Eleanor took oh, me and yeah. Chris hiking to a very special place yeah. and um, after a little bit of detour and exploration of the rest of Big Bend National Park. Three days, 24 <laughs> hours later. No. We, we, we ended up where we were supposed to be and so oh, she yeah. shared a very special place with us and we really very much appreciated that and enjoyed it. Uh, yeah, yeah. It, it was it, great. It was definitely, I, I felt like we got out yeah. into Big Bend National Park and then Eleanor saved us on the way back to the truck. She sure did. She, she was like, it's that way. We need to go that way. River, River Road West. Yeah, River Road. 59 miles of rock and sand. There were some wild horses, mm -hmm. but you know, if you if you drop the bike, they say hit the rocks, not the cactus. And <laughs> yeah. there were tons of cactus. Everywhere yeah. you look, big ones, even little bitty ones that you gotta watch oh, for yeah. as you're walking. to all of the motorcycle riding that we did in Big Bend National Park and yeah. Big Bend Ranch State Park, yeah. we also took a trip to Mexico. Prius Jody. Okay, remember Flor. What? Flor. Flor? Flor? Yeah. 
Oh, oh. How do you say that? I'm gonna pull it back. Okay. <laughs> Once you get into the village, uh, we we went to one of the two restaurants. Yeah, there's only two restaurants. One on the left, one on the right. The one on the left overlooked the... Uh, Rio Grande River. Yeah, Rio Grande River. So that's the one we wanted. And super and nice, very clean, mm -hmm. great food. Yep. And that's the one our friend had recommended yeah, too. Yeah, it is. To go to the one to the left. And it was very nice. Yeah. It was very nice. So we very much enjoyed our time in Terralinga, Texas. Yeah, loved it. The Big Bend area. We would go back in a heartbeat. Loved all of Texas. Yeah, absolutely. So thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. And we'll see you at the next one. We'll see y'all. Oh God. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> one second. Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. Okay. You ready? <laughs> the saddle moved. Well, they're, they're just loose. Ride a donkey. <laughs> Two donkeys. Yes. Yeah, we did not both on the same. Sorry, we'll start that over. Mary and Joseph there. <laughs> Poor donkey. It's all bow back now. <laughs> So in addition to all the motorcycle riding in Big Bend National Park and Big Bend Ranch State Park, did you realize? <laughs> <laughs> like an old country man. <laughs> Showing your age. <laughs> like Sesame Street. <laughs> that was, <laughs> I don't know if I've ever heard you do that. <laughs> Oh!